technology. It is in the industry, the fintech, financial technology. And we know many things have changed. But one industry that had not changed for centuries is the money industry. And that's why we're, what we're talking about today, cryptocurrency, this is just a revolution changing from paper money and plastic money to digital money. The money that you cannot feel, touch, see, but it is there. If you import computers here, what have you imported? It is still money. But if I'm receiving just 10,000 US dollars from the US, I have to answer why I'm receiving this money and where I'm going to spend this money. But when I'm receiving computers worth 1 billion Uganda shillings, no one is going to ask you, why are you doing business with computers and where are you going to spend the money after saving the computers? Do they ask them? You just clear tax that pay taxes because the taxes will pay all this system that people don't work or they are, have small children or they are wound somewhere. So we have a system that soon will go down. Feel like that. You have so much more because you have, have the interest of knowledge. In Sweden, young, young people, children, because I have, I have finished my handicap work now, so I work more in, in school, teaching, not because I'm a teacher, but because some teachers need holiday, and sometimes they are sick. And then I go in and try to, to help out. And I have seen so many of the Swedish children when they come to class, and they say, ah, why should I listen to you? They, they are not interested because it's for free. I'm going to go Uganda. I'm going to Success Factory. I'm going to go to the success factory. I'm going to Actually, my mentor, my sponsor, a uh, 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 friend of mine, she's called Anne Mali. She's been from uh, Sweden, right off from Sweden, and we've had a very beautiful event today. It's been today, it's been here at our office. Hello, this is Anne Mali from Sweden, and I'm so happy to be here in uh, Kampala in Uganda to, to get together with Tony and his uh, team. I can already see great leaders in this team, so I'm humble in for the future. So we work together as a dream team. Yeah. 